I'm having to steal Sean's Forster for just a minute. Today is gonna be an awesome day because we are getting the WRX painted. Finally, I've been waiting to do this forever. I just got back from SEMA and it is now time. All right, Sean, how are you looking? I'm really mad at myself because I didn't vlog this earlier, but we actually took all of the wide body pieces off. As you can see, the bumper's off now. So the car is completely disassembled and ready to be painted. So we're actually gonna take all of my wide body pieces and the bumper to the paint shop. Sean actually knows the owner of the Mako paint shop near where we live, so I went over there and gave me a really good quote. Me and him are gonna load this all into his Forster and then take it over to be painted and drop it off. Should be about a week or so. Um, I don't really know how long it'll be before I'm able to get it back, but <laughs> this is how the car is gonna have to sit. Makes me very nervous to leave the car like this, actually. There's literally nothing. And I mean, you guys saw the video previously where I literally cut the entire fender out of the car. So literally nothing there, front and rear. Whatever, we'll make it work. Back up the Forster. Cool. Well, here's how she's gonna sit. <laughs> Dude, so lucky on the bumper fitment here. It literally fits absolutely perfect. Cool, so now we just gotta put all of these pieces in there and take it to the paint shop. So the reason I'm actually doing a Mako paint job is just because I know in a couple of months or even a couple of weeks, I'll be doing um, a full wrap on the car. I just want the car to be color matched. I just want the car to be color matched right now. So it'll look good for a while so I can get the Meisters on. It's gonna be insane. I'm so pumped. Drop my car from my apartment real fast, hop in with Sean. Me and him are gonna ride over to the paint shop to drop all of the pieces off. I think it's the battery. So bad news, I left the car when we were taking everything, the bumper all flares off. I left the car running so we could listen to music and the battery dies, so we gotta jump the car real fast before we can go. All right, thankfully Sean is here because I would've been screwed. So I rev his up a little bit. So my place real fast and then the body shop. Comes out yeah, a week turnaround time, dude. That's Pretty solid. Cool. Two thousand years later, my kit is finally done. The shop actually pushed it back like a few dates. I'm actually not mad about that because they took their time and it came out really, really good. I'm stoked. The only thing that I am worried about is the fitment. I haven't seen the wheels with the actual kit on, so I'm not too sure on how the fitment will look. But that's what me and Sean will work on tonight. Well, I think it'll be fine overall, but. 
Uh, we're gonna go pick it up right now and then throw it on and we'll see where the stance is at the moment. And we're here. We're gonna head to the back, grab the parts, and we should be good. Parts are inside there. So stoked to show you guys, it's gonna be incredible. Jeez, came out so good. The flake and everything. Packed up, good to go. You like that, Sean? Yep, it's really, it's really good. Dude, it came out really good, like really good. All right, we finally made it back. We're gonna go ahead and unload everything, and then we're gonna start. Yes, I realize it's another short, unfinished video. I'm sorry. I was just so backlogged that I really didn't remember like what I had filmed and what I did film, and then like things were overlapping. There's excuses, but I realized that this one was a little short as well, and it's kind of unfinished. I'm sorry about that, but I'm trying to get these out as fast as possible because I just spot something new, and it's gonna blow your minds, and I want to get to that point. So you guys will see that. But yeah, so I finally got the car color matched. It is painted. I opted to go with paint just because I really like the color of my car now and I couldn't decide on a wrap color so I thought I would paint it for now and just let it look good like that and then when I decide to rebuild my work Meisters I'll get the works a different color as well as the car and just do like a different stage of the car if that makes sense whether it be a few weeks from now or a few months from now I just really like the color of my paint and plus the bumper was really messed up and I had to get that painted before it's wrapped anyways so I just said if I'm gonna get the bumper painted I might as well get the fenders painted and I'm really happy I did because the shop did an incredible job the color match is perfect Perfect. You guys will see it better in the next two videos. The next video you'll see will be uh, me and Sean putting my extended studs as well as my spacer on so that we could actually fit the Workmeisters onto the car. So next video will be you guys seeing my car with the Workmeisters on. And then after that will be the full reveal video, you guys seeing the car fully put together, lowered, everything. It's gonna be awesome. I'm very excited for you guys to see that, but I just wanna get these pumped out as quickly as possible because you guys are really gonna like the car whenever it's done if you haven't seen it already. I don't, I don't. Um, I know that I'm really far behind. I'm just trying to catch up on all of my videos. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys are excited as I am. See the reveal video. It's going to be great. I will see you in the next one. Peace out.